polycystic ovarian syndrome or PCOS is now becoming a very common problem. It is seen as much as 20% of our OPD patients present with symptoms and signs of PCOS. This is a very common problem now cropping up especially in the reproductive age group that is uh, you know women between the age of 20 to 35 years. Very commonly the presentation is increasing in weight, irregular menstrual cycles, loss of crown hair and hair in the other places where it should not be that is the male pattern hair, uh, chin hair, uh, facial hair, hair on the rest of the body and a loss of hair on the head. This uh, syndrome is also now being found to be a metabolic syndrome and it runs in families. And what has been found is that there is a very close link with diabetes in the family. It runs in the women of the family. Most of the time, you, you know, uh, girls and young women uh, may present either to the gynecologist when they have irregular periods or if they have a lot of acne and they have a lot of facial hair, they may actually first be presenting to the skin specialist. Either way, polycystic ovarian syndrome, since it has so many symptoms and signs, uh, they may go to a different specialists. So therefore, it is very important that we must be very aware of this syndrome so that this is picked up right in the beginning. A uh, lot has to do with our lifestyle. Now, the genetic uh, component of PCOS, uh, well, you could say that you can't do anything about the, uh, the genetic uh, aspect or the hereditary aspect of this metabolic syndrome. But as is, as is very true of all other metabolic syndromes like diabetes, there are a lot of modifying factors, uh, what we call them environmental factors or, or lifestyle issues. So if a woman who has been diagnosed as having PCOS, well, she need not panic. She should come and get herself checked, get the entire hormonal profile done. And the first and foremost, she should change her diet and her lifestyle. After that, she may require to be put on medication for some time and thereafter, uh, she can lead a perfectly normal life. What is important to understand that just like diabetes, PCOS is not completely treatable. I have patients asking me, uh, can it be completely cured? Well, it can be brought to an absolutely normal level under control. But it is not something which can go away. So you have to understand that PCOS has to be brought under control and in various phases of life and uh, move on and keep it under control.